name is Chris Kenny, I'm a junior sous chef at Le Manoir Quattro Zone in Oxford. Uh, the qualification I study for was a sitting girls MVQ level 2 and 3 in catering and hospitality. Gaining the sitting girls qualification has really improved my life. I got the hands on experience that I needed, I got the contacts that I needed. I managed to progress to a, a restaurant of a really high standard, and yeah, I've never looked back. I'm Sean O'Neill. I was an apprentice for two years in London Underground, but now I'm a station supervisor. I'm actually the youngest female supervisor on the network, which is, I think, ever. I'm the youngest female supervisor ever. My name is Sean Crossan, and I studied MVQ Level 2 and 3 Psych Half Korean Joinery. The Sitting Guild's qualification has improved my life because I'm out working, I earn my own wages, I can stand on my own two feet and live, and I've got a good job. The thing that attracted me to a City and Guilds course was the fact that I could earn money while I was learning, gain independence for myself and then also I wouldn't be putting myself into the debt which my friends have been put into. The key benefits of learning on the job, first of all, is hands-on experience. You know, you're not in a classroom, you're in the kitchens learning. It's not about writing it on paper, you know, it's about tasting it, it's about technique and cooking it. You've got to get it right. It's no longer being assessed by a teacher, you're being assessed by the industry now. When you actually do the hands-on experience and you use what you've learned in the classroom in real life, that's how you remember. It's how you learn and adapt to the customer's needs. Sitting Girls qualification has given me the ability to do what I'm doing in real life in my career. Transport for London for me was just a brilliant choice. It's a big, big company and there's so many opportunities for you to succeed. You know, They support you with everything you do. Throughout the two years of training that I had, um, the trainers and all of the courses that I'd done were delivered to their highest standard um, and that's one of the reasons why I was so successful once I went out into the business. Winning the Line Award was great, it was a great confidence booster because you know you get recognised for, uh, for all the hard work that you're putting in. It's helped me a lot because if I didn't go to college and do the qualification I could still be working in you know, the pub down the road of my house. You can go and really achieve some amazing things. It showed recognition in my achievements and what I'd done over the last three years. It made me feel good because I'd, I'd achieved what I'd set out to. I believe that helped my application to progress up the career ladder. Towards the latter part of my apprenticeship, I won the award of London Underground Apprentice of the Year. I was really shocked. I actually cried, so if you look at the pictures you can see that I was crying. I went to the National Apprentice of the Year. I won that, I mean, I was just completely over the moon. Two days later, I met Boris Johnson, so that was um, an experience. It's something different, it's something to tell the children when I'm older. I'd definitely recommend somebody takes a sitting girl qualification. It will allow you to get a career, move forward in your life. There's so many different qualifications you can choose from that you can move into any industry that you'd like. I started at Le Manoir as an apprentice. I've worked my way up through the ranks. Now I'm in the position where I can give back and start training the next kind of generation of, of guys coming here. It's, it's really nice to be able to say that, you know, the past two years' experience of my training has been really positive. Next three years, I hope to either find a job in a management position out on a construction site or possibly start my own building company. If I hadn't have done the Seating Guilds course, I wouldn't have been in a position to have win the awards that I have done. It's given me a great foundation for a career. My ultimate ambition is to eventually get my own restaurant. The great thing about the skills that I've gained is I can go wherever I want in the world. I've got so many opportunities. At the moment, I'm trying to keep all of my doors open. My aim is to be Managing Director of London Underground. Hopefully, we'll see you there.